Okay, it's not pretty, and it's not perfect, but it works. So I'll give you the quick tour. The water comes out of the blue hose, goes down and around the barrel. Don't know why, it's just the way it coiled. It goes into the pump. And the pump is a little 12 volt pump. And right this moment, it's being powered by uh, AC. But now that I've got it all hooked up, I'm gonna hook it up to a solar panel, charge controller and a battery. Uh, probably a single 100 watt solar panel. I'm hoping that'll be enough juice. This thing only draws about three amps. That's a three amp wall wart, so it'll probably work. So back to the pump. Blue comes out of the barrel, goes into the pump, and then all I had was red left. So then it leaves the pump and it goes through the red hose. in to this the endless coil it's about 375 feet of PEX tubing on a 4x8 sheet of plywood it terminates right there and I'll give you the back side that's the not so pretty part because your screw sticking out everywhere. Put the hot leaves at the back of the panel. Goes up and goes back into the barrel. So I just turned it on. I know it's not going to be that hot. And it's warm. It's warm already. It's only been on for a little bit. And our skies are a little bit hazy today. But it's literally just circulating. Circulating the water through the panel. And I like to shove the hose all the way to the bottom. Because then the hot water comes out of the bottom of the barrel on the inside and it rises on its own, kind of creating its own little current. All right, this is the last of the four tests. This final configuration is the one I like the best. I kind of knew I was going to go this way in the end, I suppose, but I started small just to see what happened. And this final one, I'm happy with. Today was a 79 degree day is what it got up to during the test. And the water got to 124 degrees. And I'm happy. Uh, it does everything I would hope it would do. Which is melt the skin off of my body. <laughs> But I'll just add a little cold water to that and it'll be great. Total cost for me was about $130 to do this entire project. I had the lumber already. 